So I briefly wanted to talk about opioid conversion charts, specifically the conversion of oxycodone and dilaudid, and just like give you guys a quick way to convert from PO dilaudid to IV dilaudid and PO oxycodone, because it's something we do pretty frequently in the hospital. And you can pull up all of these different charts uh, like we have here, where it's gonna tell you, um, you know, equal analgesic opioid dosing. But for me personally, I find that even still, they're kind of a little bit clunky in terms of a direct comparison of how much, you know, PO oxycodone is this dilaudid dose equivalent to. So just to illustrate that, so you know, you've got your oxycodone here and you've got your hydromorphone here for dilaudid. Then you've got oral and IV. And so if you did, for example, five of oxycodone, then that's equivalent to hydromorphone 7.5 divided by four, which is like 1.8 PO dilaudid. It's just really kind of clunky. And uh, you know, for me, I'm very much an oxycodone kind of guy. I'm very comfortable with oxycodone 2.5 for the elderly patients or oxycodone 5 for normal patients and oxycodone 10 for people who are more resistant. And uh, I'm just a lot more comfortable. And you'll find at your institution, you probably have a preferred, uh, you know, opioid pain medication that you use as well. And so honestly, for me, I've made some Anki cards on this, and I honestly felt like it was easier and more simple to just say, hey, what is the conversion factor or what is the ratio of PO dilaudid being converted to PO oxycodone? So for example, uh, I wrote in this Anki card here, what is the conversion factor of PO dilaudid to PO oxycodone? And I wrote that the strength is 2.67 times stronger. So it's a little bit you know, it's a little bit weird, but roughly one milligram of PO dilaudid is equal to 2.5 milligrams of PO oxycodone. So you can see in this uh, extra section here, I've kind of written that out. So if I want to give somebody the equivalent dose of five milligrams of PO oxycodone, then I would give two milligrams of PO dilaudid. And on that same note, uh, you know, converting IV dilaudid to PO oxycodone, this is very, very common. I know you can calculate all the oral morphine equivalents and everything like that, but keep in mind that most of those calculators only work for oral conversions and they don't work for IV conversions. And so specifically in this case, when I was converting things from IV dilaudid to PO oxycodone and just kind of giving me a rough guesstimate of how much I was giving somebody, if I was giving them a 0.2 milligram dilaudid dose or 0.4 milligram dilaudid dose, this was very helpful because you can't easily convert it to an oral morphine equivalent uh, on those calculators. So the conversion factor of IV dilaudid to PO oxycodone is 13.3 times. So 0.2 milligrams of IV dilaudid is equivalent to 2.6 milligrams of PO oxycodone and 0.4 milligrams of IV dilaudid is equivalent to 5.3 milligrams of PO oxycodone. And to be honest, I think I was probably underdosing people a lot of times because I was less comfortable with the IV dilaudid dosing. But now that I know that 0.4 milligrams is pretty much the exact same as five milligrams of PO oxycodone, I definitely feel more comfortable going up on that uh, and, and you know, giving a higher dose if somebody's already been not tolerating five milligrams of PO oxycodone. Finally, converting IV dilaudid to PO dilaudid. So IV dilaudid is five times as strong as PO dilaudid. So that makes the conversion much easier. So if somebody is on four milligrams of PO dilaudid, the equivalent IV dilaudid dose would be 0.8 milligram. Anyways, that's just my method for quickly converting dilaudid to oxycodone doses, just because I'm more familiar with the oxycodone ranges. And uh, I'm curious to hear if you guys have a simple, uh, a more simple approach to this, or if you just kind of are very comfortable with your dilaudid IV dosing and converting all the different values between each other. Like I said, I know we have these opioid anal equal analgesic dosing charts, but I really found them very clunky to use. And for me, it was just simpler to understand that, you know, PO dilaudid is 2.6 times stronger than PO oxycodone and IV dilaudid is 13 times stronger than PO oxycodone. And that really helped it make it a lot easier for me to um, convert them in my head. Thanks again for watching. I'll see you in the next video and peace.